Hey everyone, it's Lynette Chandler from TechBaseMarketing.com. Today I'm going to show you a video how to make transparent images. This was something uh, somebody asked and I thought, hey, that will make a great video. And you can use a variety of different tools, including the famous Photoshop if you have it, or GIMP. But I'm going to show you something that's free, that's easy to use. You don't have to install anything on your computer. It's called Pixlr. Uh, you can get it at pixlr.com. Again, there's nothing to download. So you just go to open it up in your browser and then click Open Image Editor. Then you'll be pre presented with this option. Uh, right now, I just want to create an Im a new image. So let's say you are creating a button, like an ad. So you give it a name. So the nice thing about Pixlr is that it gives you uh, some preset buttons. So if you're creating an ad, it would definitely be very helpful. But let's go ahead and create a medium rectangle. And this is one of the key things that you need to do is click on transparent. And what happens is that it will give you a canvas. This is my canvas. And the canvas is uh, transparent. And how do I know it's transparent? Because of the checkerboard a design here and almost any of the image editors the, that you that you may encounter that may, you may use like Photoshop and GIMP uh, they represent transparent backgrounds with that checkerboard design and well let's say we, I want to add an image to to this so what I do is I'm gonna go ahead and click layer and open image as layer and and then I'm simply going to click this a box and there's my image and I can move it around by clicking that first so I have an image right there and then I want to create text now I can go ahead and select my text color here or I can also edit the text color later so let's do that let's say report download now okay and of course I can choose whatever font size that I want to, to use here so let's choose something that's nice and heavy right there I also could and it's also change the uh, size of the text by using the slider or by typing it directly in here and then I can change the styles right. so I just want it to be regular and then next thing I want to do is maybe I want to make it like bright yellow well or maybe in like an orange of course these are optional you don't have to do that and then I'm gonna click OK and if I want to move it around again uh, I click that too. So let's say I'm done with my ad here. All I need to do now is to simply click on File, Save, and Pixelor gives you a couple of different options to save. You can save it to my computer or any one of these services. And one thing you want to notice too is that right here now the background is not transparent. How do you know? Because it is white. It's not that checkerboard design. But I want a transparent image, obviously. And the reason why is because the default option to save an Im to save an image is JPEG, and you you can't have transparent backgrounds with JPEG. So what you do is that you click use uh, PNG. You can also use GIF, but as you see, there's no GIF option here. So I'm going to go click uh, PNG, and I'm going to click OK, and have this saved. OK, uh, okay now that it's saved, what I've done is that I have a web page here. Now this was from a design earlier, uh, w something I've done earlier just to test things out. But if I refresh my page, it should bring up my new uh, image that I just created here. And there we go. And the reason why I have this uh, image with a green color background is so that you can see that it really is a transparent image. Because sometimes if you open the image up in a browser, you won't be able to tell because your browser will show the image as a, with a white background. And there you go. That's how easy it is to create a transparent background image or an image with a transparent background. 
All right. Thank you very much for your attention. Uh, my name is Lynette Chandler once again, and I hope to see you come visit me at techbasedmarketing.com.